Hi, Rodeon Jenga. This is Eakin on Fool's Gravel A1. I have a quick feedback, kind of. I'm not really prepared for this video, so I'm just going to kind of relay some opinions. I get lost immediately coming out of spawn. Uh, I know intelligence this way, intelligence that way, but I never read signs. I never really look at like where I'm going, especially in alpha versions where color doesn't really exist except for signs. Like I don't know. Don't rely on signs. Very bad. You got to lead us in the right direction but because you lead us like in either direction well I'm just gonna go down here and then I end up at my intel and it's like okay I guess I'm going this way and you just keep walking and okay so mid mid is very big very big uh, you see attacking like down here maybe it's fine but it feels really big and weird uh, the displacements on all or the great dev on all the displacements looks really ugly I know it's like dev for a reason but it still looks really ugly anyway um, a lot of people seem to not really like this dead end route down here. They've mentioned it a couple times. I think I'm okay with it generally, but I don't know. It feels pretty weird still. Uh, otherwise, the look of the map is very orange and bright. It hurts my eyes to like stare at people in the middle of the map. The middle of the map is probably too large anyway. Uh, like it's weird like combat here when you're fighting people yeah there is like height because it's all on a big ramp which is good that's good that that adds variety to the slopes and the heights of the combat but it does really feel like you're always just fighting either an uphill or a downhill battle uh, like, I don't know I'm not really sure how to describe it but maybe there's not enough cover in the middle of the map I'm not really sure just mid fighting on mid is not very fun it maybe if these routes were used a little bit more like if they were wider or I'm not really sure it just doesn't really feel fun to fight on I'm not sure what your skill level is of Team Fortress 2 um, but eventually I guess you just kinda get a feeling whether something's fun or not and fighting on mid at least is just not really enjoyable it doesn't make me want to come back to mid and, and try to fight over it maybe it is simply that there are too many places where people can be on the map at one point in time like there's a lot of routes that go this way and that way and up this way and that way and maybe it's not enough of a focused fight onto mid um especially just okay here i can talk about this one uh, i'll talk about it in a sec but like yeah, uh, mid feels it, it like not fun. Okay, um, this is another thing that got me a couple times. So say we're in red spawn and we come out this way and you're like, okay, well this clearly leads into the enemy base because like it's in front of me, right? So I'm, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going and nope, it, it just leads to my intel again. Like, I, I know it says like intel this way and stuff, but like I'm not reading signs again. Just the fact that I exit spawn and there's a doorway in front of me and I go down the route in front of me and it just ends up at my intel again. That's really confusing. If you had something like, um, I'm not really sure how you'd fix this exactly because spawn's in kind of a weird position. If this was spawn down here, so like people spawned here, well, that would actually be pretty bad too because they'd have to fight a huge, terrible uphill battle. I'm not really sure how you'd fix this other than maybe having like spawn like here or something. And then you can kind of just, you just walk in this direction. Why does my view go all crazy right here? That's very strange. But yeah, if you had like spawn kind of here and then you just naturally kind of walked this way and then, you know, you're like, okay, well, it was kind of leading me towards this way and then you'd be up here. Uh, I don't really have concrete feedback beyond those points just because I I don't really like CTF and this map is really confusing and it's not very fun for me so that's all I really have for you sorry it's not too much but um, make it less confusing on where I'm supposed to be going without focusing on signs it's probably gonna be difficult to uh, grasp because you know your map pretty well already because you made the map um, but maybe even have like a friend just kind of walk through it and tell him to like ignore the signs or even like you just like kind of naturally just don't even just just hold W and try to find where you end up and then you'll might not end up at the right place. Um, barbed wire. I'll mention that pretty quick. 
it's so punishing. I mentioned the feedback, it's punishing. And that's something, a word that I learned in my game theory class at school, which is you never want to punish your players. Uh, you always want to think how they want to think. And while it's an interesting obstacle that you need to jump over quick, if you're going to keep it, I definitely make the damage it does a lot less. Because at the moment, it does like... If you take a second or two seconds to jump over this, you've lost a hundred health. It's so horrible. Like, I feel punished. Like, I feel like I got finally into the enemy base and then I just took a hundred damage. Well, there's no way you can take down the enemy intel, which has probably inevitably got a sentry gun in it with a hundred health or forty health or something, you know? Like, I wish that there was a more concentrated force pushing on this map, but I also kind of wish it wasn't CTF because I don't like CTF because in CTF mode, typically it's just one person who has the flag who's interacting with the objective otherwise it's just random deathmatch everywhere so it might as well be something like player destruction or king of the hill or even like uh there's attack uh, or there's reverse ctf where you have to take the neutral flag into the enemy base to capture at least that means that you're bringing the objective to the enemy team and you're gonna have more interaction with the objective but this map doesn't really fit that too well because most people aren't defending from their intel rooms they're kind of pushing all over the place because where you push is pretty messy it feels like uh, so that's how I feel on the map it's a lot to talk about it's a lot of like rambling and stuff but I, I don't know I, I don't enjoy it too much it feels pretty messy it feels really bright because it's hard on the eyes um, and leading players in the proper direction feels a bit messy too okay that's it